power jab, and then a straight right hand, as well as a glancing right uppercut. Khan pulling straight back. Put himself in a bad position. You don't want to be leaning back when punch, straight punches are coming towards you. <laughs> but to Khan's credit, he got his wits about him. Even on wobbly legs, he was firing back. Round two, in that first round, Kelbrook landed 10 out of 22 power connects, 15 out of 38 total punches. Amir Khan punching back when he's hurt is not IQ, that's instinct. It's not a good idea because the Brook is that good shot right there from Amir, but Brook is watching all those shots. He's watching, he's not getting overwhelmed by the offensive con. He's stalking, he's looking, and he's trying to land that perfect punch again. The chin has long been a question. And Kelbrook able to get to him in that first round. Remember the 31 month layoff as well for Khan. That's a career long. Previous long was 23 months. Cal Brook is starting to get in the timing down of Amir Khan. You're starting to see him dodging the jab of Khan. Look for the right hand to come over the top. That's what I was going to say. Good early defense from Brook. There's big concerns about the speed of Khan, but right now that doesn't seem to be an issue. Best part about what Kyle Brook is doing, he's keeping the feet stable. He's staying close enough so he can counter Khan. He's not being flustered or pushed back with the speed and combination of Khan. Khan's looking for that big right hand, fellas. The left hand is always down for Khan. He's looking for that big right hand to turn the lights out of Amir Khan. Interesting to think, first fight with a new corner, and you face adversity within the first round. So Brian McIntyre and that team that's with Bud Crawford. We saw Bud Crawford, the welterweight champion, ringside in a white shirt in that corner. They have quite the challenge right away. Nearly got the right hand there, did Brooke. And then Khan able to just slip to his right and tie up underneath. Yeah, but Brooke has to pick his jab up. He's just looking for the big shot instead of good shot right there. He's got to come behind the left hand to blind Amir Khan so he doesn't see the shot come through. That's what's going to do the most damage. Right now, he's just loading up. Come behind the left hand, then, excuse me, yeah, come behind the left, and then bring the right hand. Khan's got to start getting his rhythm by doing just what he's doing. Pick up his jab. Try to settle himself down. Right now he's very anxious. He gave up a lot of energy before he got hit with that punch, and getting hit hurt by that punch did not help at all. Everything is high energy so far tonight in Manchester. End of two.